Hi and welcome to this tutorial in four parts where I will show you briefly how to get started with digital badges. My name is Magnus and I work on Väsbynya Gymnasium a upper secondary school in a suburb in Stockholm. This video is a product in the EU project Grading Soft Skills. This video is divided in four different parts. The first one, what is digital badges and how can I use them? The second, which digital platform should I choose? Uh, and then uh, they will follow instructions for installing WordPress on a Synology server, as well as instructions for installing badge OS in WordPress. When you have found your way here, I guess you might have heard about digital badges. But what is this? It's a digital award or a diploma, can replace or complement traditional awards and badges, used to motivate and recognize both formal and informal learning and skills, represents a visual symbol or indicator of shown interest, participation, quality skills or, and achievements validated and recognized by the credibility of the issuer. Why digital badges? Advantage of being able to include information about the learning processes, accomplishments in each badge as well as linked information about the issuer for increasing credibility. Digital badges can easily be stored, managed and spread all over the internet by both the owner and the issuer. Easier centralized administration and issuing over the internet. So where do I get started? Start by asking which competencies, skills and achievements you need to be able to recognize. Consider also the need of categor categories and possible levels in each category. What kind of evidence will be collected and how is the assessment done? The importance of integration of the badging in your own web portal or platform. In the next I will show you the available technological support and the most common platforms that are used for digital badging. There are several different internet-based systems to create, issue and manage digital badges. Some of them are totally individual, but many are compatible with the Open Badge Standard, which allows you to send and store the collected badges in your personal Mozilla Backpack account. The existing platforms work quite the same even though they look a little different. My personal opinion is that they look a little messy when they also host a lot of other issuers' badges, as well as promotion and ads for a lot of other things. Like I said, the Open Badge standard is open and free, and the standard and engine most platforms are built on. The Open Badge is created and developed by Mozilla, the organization behind the web browser Firefox. This is a guarantee that the technical service will be continued as well as kept as a freeware and open for further development by anyone. Just like with WordPress, that is also the most used content management system with more than 60 million web pages published. So if you are familiar with WordPress, you can quite easily create your own platform integrated in your own website or portal using the Badge OS plugin. I can't tell you what's the best possible solution for your need, but uh, I can give you a fast comparison. On the plus side, they, they are easy to get started and, use, and quite easy to use. It's a low entry level with low technical knowledge. They are hosted by other and they have a low initial cost. On the minus side, you have no integration with the own website and platform. You have no technical control and less impact on deployment and you have uh, uh, ongoing cost all the time. With the badge OS 
installed in WordPress, you have full integration in own website and platform. You have maximum control of all the development. It's hosted by yourself and you have a low ongoing cost. On the minus side, instead you have higher entry level, need of quite a lot technical know-how and uh, familiar with web deployment and WordPress is, is needed and you have a higher initial cost instead. You can uh, read a lot more about open badges and, and, and uh, digital badges in general on, on openbadge.org. In the last uh, two parts I will show you how to install WordPress and Badge OS. If you want to build your own portal for issuing digital badges, you need Badge OS installed in WordPress. When I consider myself having more than general technical knowledge and is familiar with WordPress from before, I decided quite fast to try to build my own platform so I can so I'm able to control and develop everything like I want myself. One way of doing this is to host WordPress on a web server. There's a lot of different companies to choose between. Just make sure to pick one that have a one-click install of WordPress in the setup and you are up running in just some minutes. When we also are collecting evidence on video and do have other great need for digital storage, I decided to go for a solution with the own small network attached server. There are a lot of different brands to choose between. If you want to be more sure, pick one with two mirror disks so you, your data is safe in case one disk will fail you. I fell for Synology when I know they are reliable and I know that the operating system DSM, now in version 6, is very intuitive and easy to use and understand. The DSM is built up with the same structure like you are used with from Windows and other operating systems. Exactly like in other systems you have a store with a lot of apps just a click, uh, just a couple clicks away. In this case you need to set up PHP database here and after this you click for installing WordPress and you are up running here as well in just some minutes. I'm sure you will find a lot of other apps and functions and in case the storage ends up you just change to larger disks for increasing the volume. The last thing you need to do for having your own badging platform is installing Badge OS in WordPress. You start with logging into WordPress as administrator. When you come in, you search and install Badge OS plugin. It should look uh, something like this. And uh, here you have plugins. This is in Swedish, but it should uh, be written plugins here in the English version. And you search for Badge OS and uh, you should get up the Badge OS plugin here. Just click the install button and follow the instructions and it should be done in just a few seconds for to be able to send badges to mozilla backpack you uh, also need another plugin as well as the api you see this here if you have searched for badge os you have the open badge issuer add-on here and you also search for json api and uh, you will find that one here also just install both of them and make sure they are they are active and uh, you should uh, be up running you also need uh, probably need uh, to to put in some social networking plugins uh, BuddyPress and BBPress are, are the two of the most uh, common ones 
and of course security and backup is also very important things when uh, running a WordPress site so you don't get lost of your information and data. How to configure Badge OS as well as build up a structure and a great looking theme will be for another video tutorial. My name is Magnus and uh, I hope you visit vespgymnasium.se grass where you will find our Badge OS website. Thank you for your attention.